Okay, so let's start out by just referring to the fact that I am slightly stupid sometimes. So I wanted to make this video explaining how to make your chat from the caffeine widget or, you know, uh, dashboard, dashboard. That's a word I want. I've been trying to get it for the last 10 minutes. Um, look like it does on mine, you know? So I'm using two monitors uh, and I'm showing you what my uh, second display looks like when I'm streaming, you know? So I have the stream on display one, which is down here, you know, straight on in front of me. And then up here, I have a second monitor. Don't ask why it's a higher. It's just, it is where it is. It, it's, it's just don't ask. Things are the way they are. So, you know, I have this up here and, uh, you know, I, I got, I got my dashboard. I have my viewer list. I have OBS open and, um, and you know, uh, you know, I got vampire masquerade pulled up. That's the game. And then, you know, I, I've got my little, uh, you know, border around my webcam all done through OBS, you know, and, and this is primarily just for YouTube videos so I can record my streams, put them up on YouTube with absolutely no editing because that's the way I am. And, uh, so people were asking, well, how do you do that? And I wanted to show how to do that. So it's, it's very simple. It's literally a display capture with two filters. So not too overly complicated. Uh, so I did a display capture. And the display capture we did picks up my second monitor. So, you know, right here we're looking at display two. Make sure you know which one is which. Oh, I should turn that off. <laughs> we'll leave it on for, uh, no, it doesn't matter. Turn that off. We don't need to see my cursor over there. Okay. So, you know, okay, display capture. Uh, now I'm going to go over and go to filters, you know, because if you don't know how to filter, you just right click on that scene and go to filters. And so when we go to the filters, you see I have a crop pad and a color key. So the crop pad, obviously, we're going to turn that back to defaults and that's what we have you know we've got the vortex and crap and it really messes that up over there <laughs> oh right so i know why that yeah mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i know why that was messed up <laughs> and anyway this is my second time making this video because it didn't work the first time it was very annoying so as you can see that's you know what it looks like uh you know let's close actually go back to filters go to go to the color key hit defaults okay so this is what we got um we'll use the lock icon to unlock it and then oh look at that we got crap everywhere <laughs> yeah so, you know, this would come up here, and of course, we've got the vortex going, and it's horrible. But as you can see, whoa, that is horrible. <laughs> yeah. Epilepsy warning right here. Okay, so let's go back to that display capture properties. We don't need the properties, we need the filters. So we we'll go back to the filters, and we're going to go to the crop pad. And this is where you crop stuff, in which I actually wrote down my original numbers, which... But where... What? But, oh, there it is. Like, when I wrote them down, but where's my paper? Okay, so let's just slide this back down. There we go. There we go. Which, you know, the numbers are not going to be the same because it all depends on how you got your setup type of deal. So left, we got it at 62. Top, we have it at 695. It's a good price. And then right, we have it at 1291. Very good year. And then that bottom, down bottoms. 
Uh, we got a 140. And as you can see, that just zones in on uh, our chat. And another thing to remember when you're cropping it is it'd be nice to just, you know, crop it down and, you know, have it real small or whatever. But you got to remember that if somebody uses a full length of characters for their message, you're going to have to be able to capture that whole stretch. So that's why the, the Fs, F and chat. Um, so we got that. That's all good. Close that. All right, so now we have this little chat box, and it's great. Uh, another thing to remember is this has to remain in the same location in order to, you know, be captured in that box. But you can move the box on your on your actual screen anywhere you want, and it'll still, you know, capture it no matter where it is on that screen. I know it's a little confusing, but if you know what you're doing. It's not. <laughs> um, so. I want it down here. It doesn't always work great having it down here. Um, personally, opinion, you know. But hey, what are you gonna do? I kind of like to line it up with my little uh, border on my webcam. Do it there. Okay, lock it in. Get rid of red lines. No more red lines. Can't move it. Um, I have not figured out how to like mount this part. I would like to be able to just pin this to like this spot. I haven't looked it up. I haven't tried, but uh, I have mine set up so it shows four uh, chat messages at a time, and it could probably do five if it's just short ones. But so we got that lined up, and you can't see you know anything else, so we're we're good. You know you can't see this stuff over here. Now what we actually want to do is. Go back to that display capture, go back to filters, and go to the color key. And, you know, to add these things, you just hit the plus and you find them down here. But the color key is what you would use for your green screen. So now we're going to pull this down. And I had heard that this was possible, and I was like, I'm going to figure it out myself. I can figure this out. And I did. So you hit the green, come down to custom color, select color. There is a color picker. So now just pick the gray. Hit OK. Blam. Close. Look at that. We have a completely see through. You know, chose the gray. Bam. Now that chat box, let's unlock it from its position. We can move it anywhere and it'll be see through. Now, depending on, you know, what game you're playing, where the other chats are, you know, you're going to have to play around with it. You know, uh, this has been working out pretty much for me with. Uh, this game and The Witcher 1. So I've been kind of just chilling with that. Put that back in place. Lock it in. And now you have awesome looking chat like that. And, uh, you know, fairly, 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 fairly simple. So, uh, yeah. Hope this helped somebody. Hope this made it look cooler for you. Um, shout out to Aviator and Aviation Nation. Uh basically made this video for you so you're welcome <laughs> uh yeah so have fun and uh let me know what you think uh let me know your tips and tricks on on how this worked for you or or suggestions that you have you know maybe different filters or you know maybe even a better way to do it because you know it would be nice to have a little scrolly stuff in there i don't know i don't know i don't like things too messy this ain't twitch baby this is clean and nice and crisp. But anyways, have a good one. Don't forget to like and subscribe and all that crap that people usually say at the end of videos that I find incredibly annoying. Uh, have fun.